So let's start our cheat day with some burek. Cheers guys, the first bite. <laughs> guys, what is up and welcome to a new video on my channel. I am Alan, 27 years old from Germany. And this video right now is really a non-planned cheat day. Yes guys, I want to do one more cheat day before I go to Japan. But without sugars, just so that you know, just because my cousin from the USA is coming to Bosnia, I want to surprise him and I also want to go to Bosnia just for a few days. And uh, yes, it's Saturday night right now and Sunday, so tomorrow in the morning I will get a flight to Bosnia and will surprise him. He don't know that I will come, but yeah, <laughs> it's going to be amazing. And just some days to spend with my family there. I'm super excited about it. And yes, guys, so the plan is to go to Boston tomorrow till Wednesday. So I will have maybe four days without training. Yes, four days rest. It's my longest rest ever since I started with fitness for over two years. But I also want to eat a lot of food. So I didn't know if I will can eat a lot of different things because I really don't know the city, but for sure I will eat some authentic Bosnian food. And I also want to try some Bosnian fast food. So really Bosnian pizza, Bosnian dinner kebab, and something like that. And so this video is more like a one or two days just whatever I want to eat video and also follow me on Instagram just to be updated this is my last video because on the 16th of July I got my flight to Japan but stay tuned for that we will have also there a lot of fun trust me and if you have some ideas or just something that you really want to see in Japan let it me know write it down in the comments so that I can make some epic videos also for you guys so enjoy the video So guys, we finally made it. After two hours fly, we are in Bosnia. What's up, man? <laughs> oh my god. We are here at Pekara Ena. It's a bakery, a Boston bakery. And I buy me a lot of goodies for the first meal. It's very early in the morning, but for sure we have to start the cheat day with some breakfast, Bosnian breakfast. This dish, you know me guys from my cheat days, it's burek. It's a filo dough with a lot of meat, minced beef, and it's fresh and super warm. Oh. Then also we got the sirnica, the small one with cheese, white cheese. And I don't know this name from this puff pastry, but it's also just a puff pastry with cheese. I never tried this before in this kind of a triangle. We will see. And also we got we got kifle, so it's like really soft bread, also fresh and super warm. And it's super cheap everything really. I buy I pay for everything and for two drinks I, I think it was about four dollars for everything. And we got ten of these and some more. And I will eat them with some pasteta. So let's start our cheat day with some burek. Oh. oh, oh man. <laughs> so good. <laughs> wow. I have to make an Instagram story. So, if you want to be updated all the time, guys, don't forget to follow me on Instagram. Let's try out strictly the Sinitsa. So, with white cheese. I'm not the biggest fan of Sinitsa, I gotta say. I prefer more Krompiro so with uh, potatoes. Man, <laughs> but let's see. Mm -hmm. For me, it's okay. It's nothing that is super special. I I really prefer more the burek i krompirsha. This is the kravata da serum, guys. Look at the cravata. Mm. Let's tear this apart and let's see what is inside. Focus. Oh yeah, a lot of white cheese. Cheers guys. Let's try this out. Mm. Better for me than the Sinita. Mm. Because a lot of 
white cheese. Oh wow. But let's come out strictly to my favorite part, the kifle. And trust me guys, only the dough without anything. It's, it's so simple, it's so cheap, but it's so damn delicious. Oh, oh wow. So in Bosnia with one mark, you what? See, if you don't have some, mark. if you are homeless, if you don't have so much money, go to a bakery, to a pekara in Bosnia. You can really be or well, stay satisfied with one dollar. Mm -hmm. But guys, this is the best part. When you eat the kifle with the pate, so the pasteta, the Bosnian one. The kifle, like dipping. Some dipping action with the pasteta and eat it. Alright. Oh. This is what you need guys, this is really, again, just soul food, oh wow. Look at it, it's really like, like a pillow. Oh. Yeah. I wish I could eat some sweet things, but I cannot, but we will have a lot of different foods, guys, trust me. This video is going to be crazy. Okay, guys, my last key player, and that was all from the breakfast meal. Mmm, that was amazing. Okay, okay, okay guys, I'm back. I just totally forget. We also got a kind of a Bosnian hot dog. It's a pastry and it's filled with a little chicken... Uh, and it's filled with a little chicken wiener. So it's a sesame pastry. And inside, oh wow, look at it, so flaky like a croissant. Ah. Oh. Mmm. Totally forget that I also buy this. And oh wow, only the pastry. Mmm. Oh wow, <laughs> it's amazing. The pastry on its own. Oh wow. And with the chicken wiener. Mmm. We need some proteins, guys. Hmm. Mmm. Mm. Oh, wow, I love it. But after, I definitely need the break. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. We'll see us with the next meal. I don't know what, but I think it will be chivapa, so stay tuned for that. <laughs> So guys, right now we are in the center of Tuzla, so let's see what we will can eat next. So guys, it's time to try the Limenka Chevape. So it's a famous Chevapchenitsa spot, so for Chevape and they make amazing Chevape, everybody said. Also on TripAdvisor it was the first place, I don't know, we will see. We will go there right now, so we are at Limenka here. We will go inside, order some Chevape with some Bosnian flatbread. So we will see. So here we got the Bosnian flatbread with the chivapa, so the beef, lamb sausages, roasted everything, and the white sauce is it's kaimak. It's like a sour cream but much thicker and fattier, guys. And look at this deliciousness. I cannot wait to try it. So, first, the chivapa, the important part, and I want to try it plain. So. Let's see if this will be good, I don't know, but cheers guys. 
The first bite. Good. <laughs> it is good. Oh wow. Mmm. So. Oh wow. Just goes up on its own. Are really delicious. But let's try out the lepinia. So the Boston flatbread. And this is my favorite thing. Really my favorite part of the chewbacca. I, I like this more than the meat by himself. Oh wow. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> this is the winner. So fatty, but so delicious. Wow. <laughs> this is so good. Come to Tuzla. Yeah. Oh. Come to Tuzla, to Limenka, and try them out. For sure, you got a lot of different other places, but this is really a good one. Just to let you know guys, Kaimak is our ranch. Definitely. You gotta try Kaimak. Kaimak is unique here too. Yeah. You don't have that in the USA. So guys, we are done. We will see us on the next place. This is not typical Bosnian, but they got also pizza here for sure. So let's try one slice. Let's see what we get. I want to try a pizza slice. Maybe it's good. I don't know, but we will see. Let's get in and take a slice. Ketchup. Yes, it's mine. Hvala. And here we got the Boston pizza. It's like a New York pizza style. So you can fold it. And here we got a champ champignons on it and also some turkey ham so with a lot of cheese and it looks amazing it looks delicious look at this guys it looks like a pizza from new york so let's try it out we will see just fold it and bite into it what mm, it's delicious i gotta say and the typical bosnian thing is that we put some ketchup on the pizza it's typical Bosnian. <laughs> you you see it only in Bosnia. In Bosnia, I think <laughs> every so. Bosnian guy mm. do this. Mm -hmm. Samik, you have to try the pizza. Try it and okay. let the people know. Hey, but you know, if if I tell you to me, look at how big I am. Everything tastes good, but let's see how this tastes. Compare it to the American ones. You are from America, so. You can compare it better than everyone. And the I must flavor. say, this is my top pizza, man. One of the best pizzas I have ever ate. Even though United States sells pizzas all over, I think that's like the main college food. It's not. I don't think I know it's the main college. Yes. Food. And but this pizza is delicious, absolutely. You gotta come to Tuzla and try right mosaic there. pizza. Mosaic pizza. It's I gotta say, it's really delicious, especially because. Uh, Boston is not a typical pizza place wow, it's good. or pizza country, I gotta say, but it's really good pizza, that's no for sure. <laughs> really good. So, a pizza slice is about 75 cents. It's a good price, it's a good deal for us, that's for sure. Food here is very cheap, cheap. Yeah. but delicious. Yes. And you can taste the quality. quality. We don't know guys, but I'm so in love with this city. This city is so beautiful. I'm not from Tuzla, I'm from Kozarac, but man, this city is amazing. I gotta say, really amazing. So guys, and right now we are at Dinar Kebab Koturcina. So it's a dinner place, dinner kebab place here at Tuzla. And here we got dinner kebab, just with meat because you know me guys, I don't like the veggies. 
but also with some hot sauce. So here we got the lepinias of the flatbread. Let's try it out. I'm super excited. So cheers. Oh. Mm. Soiler boiler. <laughs> yeah. the, the, the meat flavor is really good, I gotta say. Go. With the hot sauce. Mm. Hey, I, I love the lamb turkey, man. Beautiful lamb, man. Look at this beauty. Look at this meat. And the bread is still very fresh and warm. And you can taste it. It's. Oh. Mm hmm. Mm. Amazing, guys. For this price, wow. So, let's enjoy. Much love and greetings to Kotorcina and Tuzla. When you're here, guys, go and check them out. I must say, the, um, to be honest with you, this is like uh, Turkish. More is Turkish donut than German you yes. know, taste. And uh, I think that in Germany the donut tastes much, much better. And That's for you sure. Gotta come to go to Berlin for a good donut. But if you are in Tuzla and you want a donut kebab, then you gotta come try this one. It's not it's not expensive. It's not bad, it really is, the meat is good. Yeah. <laughs> but this is more like uh, what you would get in Istanbul versus if German, you look in, yeah. yeah, German Germany beats. See the thing about doing a kebab, uh, the whole history on it is it started in Berlin, and I don't think that anybody can beat the doing it from Berlin. That's yes. where you gotta go if you want a true doing a kebab. But for Tuzla, great job. Myself and seeing what I have within me. If you decide to drop your buckets where you are and develop your gifts. So guys, right now it's time for a break, for a hookah break at the hookah spot it calls Arvenia and it's amazing. The taste is really good, I gotta say, and it's really cheap, much cheaper than in Germany. The next day. But right now it's time to go to a place and they got a lot of swimming pools there and the rivers and it looks really really beautiful. Maybe I will show you something and later on we'll see the next spot. Cannot wait. Oh, I know some exact chocolate. Be with us. I grant you that your gifts will take you places that will literally amaze you. We are right now at the Bingo City Center just to uh, buy something from a fast food chain it's called Chick King. So it's like the Boston kind of uh, McDonald's, you know? And there is Chick King. I buy me some burgers that we want to try out. We got a, a kind of a breakfast burger with some turkey ham, cheese, an egg on a sesame bun and some ketchup. We got some chicken stripes with some fries and also we got a beef burger with the sesame bun and some ketchup. Let's try them. It's okay, but they are dry. Mm -hmm. Also, we got some soft bread. Oh wow! Let's try out the fries. Mm. The fries are good. Beef burger, but I gotta say, in Bosnia, every time the burgers, the bun, is so much thicker, so much bigger than the 
patty. So it's just a beef patty with some ketchup. But I want to try the burger, so maybe it's delicious, we will see. So cheers guys, let's bite into the burger. Mm. I love the beef flavor. Oh wow. And the sesame bun is also really delicious. Mm. So here we got some we got some cheese, some mayo, we got the fried egg and some turkey ham. So let's try this out. The breakfast burger from chicken. I gotta say too much mayo, but the egg with the thin slices of the ham works perfectly. Mm -hmm. So guys, everything is gone. Right now it's time for the next place. So stay tuned. Okay guys, and right now after the chicken, it's time again for some more chivape. I have to eat them, it's my last night. And we want to compare the Imenka chivape against right now the Saraika. And both of them are really famous in Tuzla. So let's see which are going to be better at the end. Damn, just the lepinia, so the Bosnian flatbread <laughs> looks so amazing, so delicious, fatty, oily, but it has to be like that. And here we got it. So, first the flatbread and another flatbread. All the delicious, good looking chivapa guys. Oh man, look at that. So, first the lepinia guys. Oh wow. It's amazing. Mm. I like it. But I think, I don't know what but the flavor of the bread from Limenka I think is better. Maybe. A bit with Kaimak. Oh, really? With the healthy Kaimak guys. Mm. Yeah. But let's wrap the chivapa. It's hot, it's really delicious. But both are amazing. Mm -hmm. both. Limenka and also the Saraika ones. But these are feria, more juice. Mm. Ah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Oh. But yeah, perfectly grilled. Oh wow, this is really good. Good job, Saraika. Mm -hmm. Guys, just bread. Everything is soaked up from the meat, juice, so fatty. Wow. That was delicious, guys. Mm -hmm. And overall, I'm team Lime uh, Limenka, but this is also so close. They are both are amazing. It's hard. But yeah, just to let you know guys, we will see us for the next spot and for the next items. And here we are at the Pekara, so at the bakery so guys. guys. I'm sorry I was at the uh, bakery, but uh, the, it was too late. They got nothing special anymore. And also nothing that was really fresh. But I can get again this hot dog bun and you know me guys, I loved this the last time at the beginning from the cheat day. So let's try it out again and maybe I will find something at the airport tonight and when you will see it then. But let's try to eat it first the bun from the hot dog. Mm. Damn, this bread is amazing. 
so much dough the last days, it's not normal. Only that you guys can see 122 in the night. And I also and I also buy again some burek like yesterday. Super oily again. But what you can eat really every time are the key flake guys. Even dry. Mm. But for sure we got some pastetta. So the chicken pate again. This is so amazing guys. Mm. Nothing that is too heavy or something. Really something that you can eat really every day. Mm. I wish I could eat something that is sweet. Strictly, I can feel it everywhere. Again, all the cups. <laughs> oh wow. So guys, we will see us maybe with the next meal and if not, we will see us with the end. Morning, it's 5.39 and we are in the plane. Man, I'm not hungry, but let's kill this big bad, bad boy. It's a turkey sandwich. We are on the back way home to Germany. Man, I love the Boston bread. All bread is just again so fluffy, so so soft. So guys, you can see just some chicken dilly and some pesto. But for two euros from a plane, from airport, it's okay. Too much dough the last days. Way too much. Mm. And also cheese. For two euros, perfect. And so big. I'm so full. I will enjoy this right now. But we will see us, guys, in the next video. But then I will be in Japan. So just to let you know. Mm. It's amazing, guys. So if you're new, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I hope you enjoy the video. And I'm sorry for no sweets, but you know me guys, I'm in my detox, so cheers from Bosnia, love you all, and we will see us in Japan.